Hello everyone, it's the Hidden Fire here, and welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing a sub tour on um, the Hidden to server actually. Um, it's called Iron, well, play.irondgame.net, the IP will be going along the top, um, just above my hand probably. So yeah, um, I'm just going to be basically showing you around the server, telling you what's going on, um, what's been built, things that happen in the community, of what we've actually got on the server, etc, etc. So, yeah. So, right, let's get started. So, basically, this is where you would spawn. So, do slash spawn. This is kind of like the hub slash spawn, etc. So, basically, you would spawn here. Um, if you first join, it would be like, welcome to R&D. And you would, like, basically have the option to go to each three of these. So, yeah. Um, as you can see here, we've got coming soon. That should be minigame soon. As you can see, we've got um, three at the moment. We've got Sky Island, which is through there. We've got Parkour. And we've got the main one, which is Survival. Now, if I quickly show you around, we got Skyland through here, which is basically like it's like a little like floating cabin, if you can see. Oh, what's my renders? Oh, that was just a, being the view of uh, Christy a minute ago on the admins, seeing what was the bug was. So basically, this is like a um, what would you call it? Like a little cabin type thing. Basically, showing you. Um, about the island saying how to create an island it says here to create an island do slash island to bring it up or island the sky island um, menu and start your island now if I show you this island um, it would say like go to your island and all this and then it's got like a mini shot list of team members like I've got those I've got like four people on my island if I had a look now and then you've got like list warps and all that change by to quickly show you, you've got like I've got my island here. Quite a quite a big size island. I've done quite a bit to it actually. Got downstairs and stuff. So yeah. Um you start off if I show you. You will start off with something similar to this. So you start off like a circular island and you can build out like we've done over here. And do something like that. So yeah. Let's go stuff back. And then we've got um you can also access that in um, survival if you want to, in the survival thing and in the parkour thing. So we go through here, we've got the parkour. Um, nice little uh, room built with me. <laughs> we got the um, parkour head, and if you follow through, we've got um, some of them are under construction. I think all of them, apart from the middle two, are under construction. And then we've got, we, we're going to have eyes parkour, dead parkour, dead easy. Then we've got the medium, which is forest and ladder, they're open. I'll show you them in a minute. And we've got Ender and we got Nether. And it's got here Welcome to Parkour, made by myself, Punk460, also known as the Hidden Fire Kim. And we've got Sir Adams, um, his channel, um, Four Men One Game. Um, he's VIP. And we've got Operation, also known as Ryan the Hidden Ginge. Now, if I quickly show you this, uh, I'll show you, for example, the ladder parkour. You, like, head up. Let me share this, I know I will. Pretty terrible parkour. So you look like going like this. Yeah, you get a concept. And then you end up like going up here. Oh, bump. And then you end up going up here, and it'd be like, no, you should be the parkour. Now, why don't you try a different level and see if you can beat them? So go back. And go back here. And you can go through, or you can do slash four, and it will take you back to the middle there. And then finally we got survival, which is originally what we had when we first opened the server, we had this as the original spawn. Now this is what's going to cause me lag, so I'm going to put this down to about 6, because I know I'm going to lag. So basically here is like basically the lag machine of the server. Um, as you can see I've got like a million balance because I'm, I'm one of those people. We've got um, all Christmas tinsel, like a castle style um, spawn building. Quickly pull that in the way possible. We'll get rid of that. Basically got all this. We got um actually I'll keep it on. We've got um a stained glass window. This is uh, this castle was built by me and Ryan. Then we got like the rules, we've got uh, no swearing, sex and racism, blah 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 blah, like you normally do. Um ask the staff at any time for help. If it's non priority support, submit a ticket on the website, have fun, no griefing as usual, play 24 hours and then you could um apply for a helper. I'll tell you the staff and I'll leave um, the names of the staff in the description. 
Then we've got no spamming. Uh, I hope you get along with all staff and please enjoy. Then we've got over here, it's basically going to explain about um, how to lock your like stuff using the private um, sign system. So basically, and you can use it on doors as well. You can use it on chests, trying to six um, in chunk table and handles. And then we go down here, we've got the shop. This is what actually causes the lag. So if you go down here, we've got uh, ingots, gems, food. We've got the tools, armor, farming, mob drops, uh, dyes, rare items, blocks and clickables. Basically clickables is like chest, enchantment table and things like that. And then we've got our, uh, got our mascot, uh, Mr. White, the sheep, who tends to live there now. And then over here we've got um, two enchantment tables if you want to use the enchantment tables to spawn. And then we got um, end chest here. As you can see, I've got a few, few bits in there. If we go here, uh, we got the end farm, which should be a one hit kill, which is extremely loud. Surprisingly. Extremely loud. So basically, it should be like a one hit kill, basically, like that. And then you can just dispose of your end pearls if you don't need them in there, like so. So yeah, and then we got a few crab tables over there. So we'll get back now. We can also do slash warp XP farm if you want to. Like so. And that'll take you to it. Now if we get through here, we've got um please don't make more farms. Apart there's one exception for that. You can make mini iron golem farms if you want to. There's only three at the moment that have been built, but they are in a radius, like they're very far away from each other, but they're not in a way. So they're not that far away from each other, but they are, if you get what I mean, they're like about a thousand blocks away from each other. Which is sometimes isn't that big, so yeah. Then we've got here, go build something epic, and remember to enjoy yourself, follow the rules, and for the best experience as possible. So yeah, and then if we go through, uh, Ryan changed the biome, obviously because it's Christmas, and he's built a, uh, a Christmas tree there. We've got the, over here, we've got the barracks. Nice bit of snow on the courtyard there. Little farm. Uh, like a barn there, you know, like wood log uh, pack things, yeah. And then we've got a little market, a uh, few lamps, nice little path, little uh, little middle of a town here, nice few little houses. And then we head over here, we've got the uh, path heading towards the church, which actually took me about five hours to build. So, yeah, and we've got like a few graveyards. And if I go around, I can head in from this door over here, got a stained glass window there head through here I can quickly show you what goes on inside the church so basically somehow I don't know how okay don't know why I almost got shot if you head down here you got all the pews I don't know how they got the snow got in here but oh I'll stay there and then we've got the enchantment table like a book for like hymns and stuff so I better get out of here quickly um so yeah what I'll do now is I'll quickly go and uh TP and show you around different things that we've got so far so basically at the moment there's not many people on there's been about Oh, uh, I'll be right back. Alright guys, I'm back. Sorry about that, that was um, quick server close. It's just a restart basically, don't worry. That happens in and out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly show you around, um, as I said before, I'm just going to show you the town. Uh, crazy Nose Girl's house because it looks pretty cool. Um, she lives with Death Enforcer. And of course I'll show you my house. So yeah, let's get started. So I'll be right back and I'll see you guys in a minute. Hello well, guys, I'm back. As you guys may be able to tell, I am now at the village. Um, so yeah, basically this is just what a few of the people on the server decided to throw together, just as, yeah, just decided to live together basically. So uh, yeah, so you've got um, Fletcher's, also known as Sir Adams, um, who helped create the uh, parkour, his um, iron farm, which is a work in progress. you got his friend's temple, X4. He's um, got a little church. Uh, there's the public melon farm, which is not really public anymore. Just everyone uses it. You got um, I don't know whose house this this is. You've got Edward's uh, like house over here, and you've also got his house over here, I think, as well. You've also got like the public horse um, and animal pen, which kind of got griefed, I think. Then over here is the big stuff. This is the. Um, sort of surround has been building. He's got like an automated melon farm that pushes it down and they end up coming, I don't know where it is. I well, know, I think it might be over here, I'm not sure. They come out somewhere, unless it's down here. They come out somewhere. 
And then you got um, X Force actual house. I do. I got to admit, I do like it. It does look quite nice. And then you got this, which look, just looks beautiful in this texture pack, which is I don't know whose house this is. I keep forgetting whose house is whose. This is we're going upstairs. Let's have a look. That's what I was saying. Okay, so this is X Force as well. Yeah, this is. I like this. Um, this texture pack will be in the description as well. So yeah, you got the Nether portal there, and you got the uh, public farms over here. You got some more melon farms, and then I think you got the like multi farm there. A few other farms, huge wheat farm. You've got uh, the pig. Where's the pig to? This is gone. Did they move the pig? Okay, they got rid of the pig by the looks of things, but yeah. You've got this, this is all automated as well. I think this is an automated sugarcane farm in there. And then over here is uh, a lighthouse, which I, it was like a lookout lighthouse, which got skeleton in it. But yeah, this is meant to be a submarine, which kind of got raided. Then you've got, um, so it's like jungle lookout. And of course you've got the Christmas tree over here, which I do like, actually, I do like this Christmas tree. It looks really nice. So yeah, and I'll quickly go over now. I'll be right back and I'll go and show you Crazy Girl's house. So be right back, guys. Hello, guys. I'm back, and as you can see, I'm just outside Death and Forces and Crazy Girl's house, which are actually here. Um, that's Death and Forces there. Um, basically, what they've done, they've got like this really cool house, which is perched on top of a cliff. It looks really random with slabs, but I got to say it does look pretty nice. You've got their also made uh, cactus farm there. You got the sugarcane farms, the weed farms. We should actually look pretty cool. And then you got this. It's very uh, cozy. Nice little spa bath. I like the green wall. It does look nice. You head down here. Um, this is why I like. It's got the enchantment table there. That looks quite nice. I like the uh, the way the brick con uh, contrasts with it. You head down here. You got the, um, this is what I like the most. It's so cozy. I got to admit. It's honestly apart from that wall. This is really really cozy. Nice little, I like the contrast with the nether brick and stuff. It does look really nice. If I head back through, we got um, this. This is very open planned, as you can tell. Makes perfect sense then. There's an empty bit of wall there. If I head back through. You've got um, you've got the farms out here, I think. Yep, you've got the uh, nice few uh, plants going on there. And ca uh, cactus, cocoa bean farm. And then you've got an anvil, a few like a little brewing lab, which is very nice indeed, very eerie. And you've got um, disposable waste stuff, broken anvil. <laughs> and then if you head back through here, you've got um, the nether portal and the few chests. I think that's just a basic that's storage room. You head down here, you got the so do. Oh. But that's just a um, that's just the mine, I think, for what I know. So yeah, um, what I'll do now guys, I'll quickly head up to my house and then I'll call it an end after that. So I'll be right back again. So about all this, it's just because I can't be asked to TPing. It's easier if I just go there and show you around. So yeah guys, I'll see you in a minute. All right guys, I'm back. As you can see, I'm in my house. Um, this is basically in the side of a cliff, which me and what well, actually I decided to do. So yeah, um, just got basically lobby room, map, of the old house, can't exactly see it yet. I'll come back in that minute. You've got another portal there. Um, yeah, I'm not exactly gonna die. I've got all beacons as well. So and then we've got the hidden armory down here. A few bits of stuff, etc. Close that up. Then you've got the. Uh, oh, yeah, you've got the enchantment room in here with the reset button there. If you head through here, this is like a work in progress area. As you can see, I've just got a flush piston door thing there. The open part of the wall. Not very safe, but meh, yeah, I'll be alright. Um, as you can see, the map's now loading in. I'll show you that in a minute. Um, I'll head down here. Um, we've got the beacons down here, the rest of them. An armor equipped there. Uh, it should go in my inventory, but I won't use it actually. Got a little uh, cell thing there. I'll quickly put my user down. There's. Yeah, you head over here. You got um, that's better. You got the uh, elevator there, going into the silos, which are actually full. I think that one isn't, but that one is. You head down here. We've got a secret little 
hidden room, which soon may become mine and Ryan's bedrooms, I think. So head back out. Um, I'll leave that actually. Head up here. I think they should be loaded. Um, this is the old house. Um, this is now Mashed Up's house, who's the moderator on the server. So yeah, that's basically it. Now, if you come on here, um, just so you know, the staff members at the moment are Operation, who's the Hinginge, is the owner. Then there's me, Punk460, who's the head admin slash admin. You've got Christy10, who's the admin. We've got Mashed Up, the moderator, who's friends with all of us. Then you got um, Tardis, who's the helper. So that's all we've got so far with staff. We should be fine for now, so please don't ask staff. It's Ryan will get annoyed. And yeah, that's the I'm fine. So I'll probably go back to spawn and I'll call that an episode. So yeah. Um let's go up here. Alright guys, thank you for watching. Mine's been Hidden Bar and I'll see you guys there. Bye.